chromatic orb. First level evocation, cast time of one action, range of 90 feet, components verbal, somatic, material, a diamond worth at least 50 gold pieces. At least it's not consumed. Duration, instantaneous. You hurl a four inch diameter sphere of energy at a creature that you can see within range. You choose acid, cold, fire, lightning, poison, or thunder for the type of orb you create, and then make a ranged spell attack against the target. If the attack hits, the creature takes 3d8 damage for the type you choose. At higher levels, when you cast a spell using a spell slot of second level or higher, the damage increases by 1d8 for each spell slot above first. 3d8 single target, 90 feet for a first level spell, not bad. The big thing though, and the, I mean, it's the best feature of it, is this is the fill in the blank damage type theming or getting over immunities spell. An issue with a lot of like fire focused evocationists when they bump into, or fire, like, oh, fire characters or lightning characters, when you're theming yourself around a specific damage type, is when you bump into an enemy with that kind of resistance or immunity, unless you have elemental adept, that's gonna hurt. Well, this is your way around it. You just always pick up or prep chromatic orb. It is always your general elemental type if you wish it or what you have bonuses to and the moment you come across that resistance or some other vulnerability you can adapt on the fly without having to change spells on the fly it's when you cast the spell itself i just gotta give this a nine out of ten we're not it just not too much else to say sure the scaling's eh but just that always having in that toolkit 